Quickly ahead, Chandler, spin move on Bargnani, blocked! Bargnani leads the team in block shots, now out and running. Six to four, Knicks on top of the Raptors. Marion, one of two with two points. Call their own, one of one. Bargnani drills it from deep. Bosch sends it to Jose, call their own. Guarded by the length of Chandler, now on a switch. Bargnani gets by Harrington, drills it. Uh, again, I'm not, I'm not trying to pick on Al Harrington here, but his defense is horrendous to start this game. Great job by Bargnani. 36% on the season. Been out the last three games because of back spasms. Bargnani getting what he wants. I just love the way he's playing. You know, so much confidence to get in the paint. No hesitation. He's not just relying on that three-point shot. And he believes he can post guys up. No question about it. 19-6 run over the last six minutes going back to the end of the first quarter. Bargnani in the post. Double comes. Bargnani goes up strong. And that's what I said earlier. This is where the game has to turn for the Raptors. Bargnani and Bosch, not jumpers, but get in the paint, look to get to the rim, find a way to get to the free throw line. The advantage is there. There is not a shot blocker on this New York Knicks team that is going to pose a problem for Bargnani or Bosch. They need to get to the rim. It has to be done with post-ups. It has to be done with quickness off the dribble. Bargnani, an 83% free throw shooter. You see what he has done in the last 13 games that he has played in. Didn't play in the first game of this winning streak against the Clippers because of the heel. But he has started now 55 games. Jose to Bosch. Bosch, high-low game. Bargnani crowding Bargnani in the post. And three-second violation. That was a quick three. I was just going to say that very quick three. Andrea Bargnani just caught that ball and was just trying to gather himself in the whistle blue. Jay Triano talking to the officials right now. He really, he, just by his body language and sideline activity, he's not been too happy with some of the calls he's seen here. Chandler has it stripped away by Jose. Marion gets it back to Calderon. Calderon looks out of the wing. Parker, Parker puts it on the deck. Finds Bosch. Back up. Bargnani got it. Quick pass from Jose Calderon. That's a tough shot right now, and that's what they've been getting. Duhon has really exploited the Raptors with his ability to get down into the lane. Harrington now trying to deal with a Bargnani. Nice spin away toward the end line, and he drills it. Harrington, as you've mentioned, hasn't been able to hang with him. Yeah, and if you've got a guy like Bargnani that's getting it going right now, continue to feed the fire. He's the one guy displaying a hot hand. Turnover. Jeffries. Bargnani with the block. Takes it back. Andrea head to Parker. Numbers three on one. Il Mago. I'm the big fella. I think players have a tendency to forget that he's the seven footer. And even though he looked like he was going to get beat on that drive, he makes the block. And how about the legs to get down the floor and finish? David Lee. Bargnani turning it over here, but getting back, and Jeffries thinks he's got an easy layup, but Bargnani left hand with the block, gives it up. Remember, he turned it over in the first half, dribbling, and gets it right back for the slam dunk. Outstanding effort at both ends. This does not have the hectic pace. Last time, Bargnani from deep, 21 now. Andrea Bargnani showing his skills here. This is the fear for Mike D'Antoni when Duhon leaves the game and Nate Robinson's running the show. They kind of get away from the things that we were talking about uh, and the Raptors taking advantage of it. Back-to-back -back threes. Andrea Bargnani, defense flying at him, put it on the floor. Defense came again, and then he found Parker deep in the corner. Coming together. There it is. Flying at him, puts it on the deck. Robinson came at him. Finds Parker who drills it. Largest advantage for the Rams. Hyundai's smart player, Andrea Bargnani. Doing a lot of good things here for the Raptors on an afternoon where they're struggling, knocking down the three-point shot, looking to take advantage of his size down low on the blocks. And even helping out a little bit defensively, blocking shots. It's using that size of his. Able to extend and keep the ball in play as well. One thing blocking the shot, another thing keeping the ball in play. And smart guys, Bargnani and Calderon, 21 and 13, seven assists for Jose.
there's been a big difference in this game when Duhon has not been on the floor. He's been leading this team. He's been creating opportunities. And Nate Robinson, he may be spectacular, but he has not been effective in this ball game. How about that by and Andrea Bargnani? He gets a rebound. He has a shot, but Bosch is closer. Finds him, knows that he needs to get a rolling. And Bosch gets fouled. He's going to go to the line. Uh, no one's ever questioned Andrea Bargnani's ability to be a team player very unselfish and the right decision too yeah. not only was he getting looking for Bosch but it was the right play at the right time There's Richardson Bargnani comes over with the block Bargnani closes out on Jeffries Jeffries denied Joey Graham takes it away from Wilcox by my count, Bergnani's got to be up to five blocks in this game. He's just done a great job of getting up and being disruptive. 14 minutes, here's Bargnani, driving strong. Gets it back to Graham over Richardson. I love that drive by Bargnani. As soon as he caught that ball, he just took it to his right hip, swept it down on the floor and attacked, but then able to get the ball back. Look, there was some contact, didn't get it, but it didn't stop. Shot clock down to seven. Bargnani up fake, gets by Harrington. Jeffries flies at him, fouls him, no call, still makes it. 23 points. Love that release. He's just so confident, gets that shot up in the air, and can't stop this guy. And applauding to them as we send it to Bruce. All right, Matt, here's Andrea Bargnani, 23 points on the day for the Raptors. Andrea, your team trailed by two at the half. You seem despondent going into the locker room. What did you say to each other to come up with more fire in the second half? We say that we have come back with uh, a lot of energy, and that's what we did. We came back with great energy, and uh, we played great D. And, I mean, the offense was coming after the defense. This was, is your team's first six-game winning streak in almost two years. Why has it happened this late in the season? Well, you know, we got a big change with uh, Sean and uh, J.O. traded. So you need a little bit of time to, to get adjust and to find the right chemistry when you, when you make uh, such a big change. Man. How about you and the way you found your offense today? You, you mixed it up a bit, didn't you? A lot of fakes and drives to the hoop and some three-pointers as well. Uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, I tried to do a little bit of everything because uh, they, they switch. Uh, every screen a lot, they switch. Uh, so you, you, a lot of times you got a smaller guy on you, you got to try to go on the post. I'm curious, last time you guys came into Madison Square Garden, you really got blown out. Was that on your mind at all today oh, yeah, to come in sure. and right the wrong? For sure, we got embarrassed last time, so for sure we, we had some pride today. Andrea, great game. Thank you. Bye. 23 points for the Raptors. There is Andrea Bargnani.